Oh god. I just spilled some energy drink on my shirt. What a great start for a video. And there are some stains on the shirt too. I really need new clothes. So yeah, hi guys. It's time for good content. Because I'm gonna draw once again. Seriously, you can't escape this hellhole. And to be honest, I feel quite tired. My eyes feel heavy. I just want to take a 10 hour nap. But I'm gonna do this. Just don't be surprised if I look like Pennywise from the ending of it. So lately I've been watching a lot of Pop Team Epic. You know, the anime that literally everyone keeps talking about and you see it everywhere. The anime that saved anime. And I loved it. The first time I watched it, I was like, what is this? What the hell am I watching? But after that I fell in love with it because it's funny, it's weird and I highly recommend everyone to watch it. The show has this very cute and unique art style and I've been itching to draw something in that style. So I thought today I'm gonna draw some of my fellow YouTubers in Pop Team Epic style. And I actually asked you guys on Twitter and Tumblr who should I draw, who would you guys like to see? And <laughs> and literally all the suggestions were Dan and Phil. Why do I bother asking? Honestly, the answer is always Dan and Phil. So yeah, okay, I'll draw Dan and Phil, but you know, I have to draw someone else too, guys. That's just the way it is. I'll start with Jacksepticeye. Sorry, fandom. Because when I first saw this Totoro parody scene in episode one, I knew I had to draw it with Jack and Septicai Sam. So I guess this drawing will be a redrawing of a redrawing. Retroception. So how am I gonna do this? I immediately have so many regrets. That looks like Ash. I hate round shapes. of Jacksepticeye and Septic Ass. He's gonna have his tail run over by a bus for sure. Okay, the line art's done. So now the real fun, aka suffering, begins. Adding colors. Oh yeah, he doesn't have his green hair anymore. Feels so wrong not to give him green hair. <laughs> why do you do this to me? This is why change is not good, kids. Oh no! Which one looks better? Okay, I'll just keep the black hair. Deal with it. I'm gonna give him a green jacket like the one he's wearing in one of his Instagram photos. If the hair is not green, the jacket is. Gotta have green somewhere, okay? I used to hate drawing backgrounds, but nowadays I find it so relaxing. But only outdoor series though. Everything else is still pure hell. <laughs> Aren't you just glad you can see all those fine details I just spent half an hour drawing? Am I the only one who drinks energy drink from a mug with a freaking straw? 
Like a lot of you may know, Dan and Phil are having another tour this year and they are actually coming to Finland too. Like what the hell? What were you thinking? <laughs> okay, I'm just kidding, obviously. I tried to buy a ticket for myself, but they sold out like in four seconds, so it's okay. This is fine. This is fine. I am not salty at all about that. I'll use these two pictures as a reference for this drawing. I think it might look cool. I don't know. Let's find out. The most difficult part is always the beginning. You just stare at the blank canvas, not knowing what the hell are you doing, and you just want to f***ing quit. That looks like a f***ing egg. <laughs> it looks like a baby Zoidberg. Dan only has four fingers. Whoops. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with the background though. Should I add pillars? This looks like a huge mess. The world's ugliest most unrealistic microphone ever. Let's just not stare at that for too long. I forgot to draw the holes in his jeans and that is a disgrace. Free the skin. Oh yes, so much better. Now it actually looks like him. Like, huh, who is this guy? Oh yeah, definitely Dan. I totally drew that logo myself, by the way. In my opinion, every drawing looks cooler with glowing stuff. Those random glowing particles. What are they? I don't know. I don't care. The picture looks cooler with them. <laughs> always just stare at this and cry because I know I will not be able to go to their stage show. <laughs> okay, that's the saddest thing I've ever said. Look at those chubby cheeks. It is so cute. It should be legal to look that squishy. I think I'll make the last one a little bit simpler. Just a simple picture with no background or something. Is this simple? I need to draw this. It screams for a cool couple. And bam! A cool couple. What are proportions? I don't know. It's not like I'm an art student or anything. I have no idea what her shirt says, but it's okay.
totally not trace that text either. A lot of glowing stuff and a little bit 3D effect and this is done. Look at them, such a cool couple, just having a cool time. This is what tells you you spend too much time on a computer. It's red and swollen and it hurts. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed my drawings. Which one was your favorite? Let me know down in the comments. I think they're all pretty sexy. Be sure to give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this and subscribe to my channel by clicking subscribe. Also be sure to check out my latest video if you want to know about the things that annoy me, aka the world. <laughs> The world annoys me. Let me know if you want to see something like this again. What would you guys like to see me draw? Or should I just stop? That's one option. Let me know and as always guys, stay adorable and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye bye.